Okay, so I tried to do a resistance test and it's, it's just really weird. So I've got a running voltage drop test. So if I put both terminals together, you can see we've got less than uh, 0.05 millivolts. Now if I walk away from my negative lead is pretty much right on the battery terminal. We'll come on over here, about 0 0.4, 0 0.5. Okay, if I come up this tributary here up to this 0.4 up here, point, uh, 13 point across the fuse, we're gonna see some extra, that's not bad. But now if we come back across this, this safety terminal, we see 0.4. Now, if we jump this bridge, we're at 500 millivolts. So across here is a significant resistance that when current is flowing through, creates a tremendous amount of heat. Right now, it's only been running a few minutes, but we're at um, 160 degrees yeah, up here. We got nothing. This is, the, I can't even put my hand on it, it's so hot. It just, it, to me, I'm curious why it's not reading even higher. Yeah, about 150. So this is the explosive part. Well, there's a, a special small charge in here and these separate when, they, uh, when it goes off. This is usually covered by a uh, plastic. So, uh, 500 bucks to replace this. Uh, do just the part at ECS, they've got them. We'll have to figure something out.